Dear students, in this video, we will see some analytical questions from ISET previous year question papers. Right. The first question here is DEF, then we have a next time is 360, then is proportional to HIJ, then semicolon, what term we will get here. So DEF 360, then HIJ is what? So here we have to find the relationship between first DEF and 360. How this uh, is related, these two are related. So here after when you observe here, what is the serial uh, in the alphabet in the alphabets, what is the serial number of D that is equal to 4. Then what is the serial number of E that is 5. So D is 4, E is 5 and then the next is what? F is 6. So now if you multiply this 4 multiplied by 5 multiplied by 6. How much this is? 4, 5 is 20, 26 is 120. So 120. So here what we are saying? 360. So 120 if you multiplied by 3 what we are getting here? 360. Now we will see this one. H I J. So what is the serial number from starting from A? For H for H it is 8. For I it is 9. For J it is 10. So using the same logic we multiply here 8 multiplied by 9 multiplied by 10. Right, 10 9s are 90, 9 8s are 72. So this comes to how much? 720. So this multiply again by 3 because here we have multiplied by 3. You multiply this also by 3. 720 multiplied by 3 means 72 into 3 is 216 followed by 10. So 2160. What is the correct answer here? Correct answer is option number 4. Now next question. Round then you are having followed by NDURO. Then KX for what? So round is becoming something like this. NDURO. Then KX should become what? So these are analytical questions. Uh, so round if you see carefully here. RO and ND. So ND and RO the positions have been interchange. So this has been ND is replaced with RO and RO is replaced with ND. So you remain in the same place. So using the using the same logic. So what we will get here? Uh, K will remain in the same place. K in the middle will remain in the same place. So CA will go to the last and ES will come to the front, uh, front end. So here ESKCA. ES KCA. So this is the correct answer. So this is somewhat easy. Anyway, you have to think all these things. Now coming to the next question. Analytical question here. 217 is becoming what? 344. Four. So 217 becomes 344. Four, then 344. Then 730 should become what? So 300, uh, so 217 is becoming 314 uh, or we can say as continuous numbers. 2117, 217, 344, then 730, then what? So 217, mostly it is in the squares, cubes like this, or some multiplication, or some Fibonacci series. So you have to, uh, so 217, if you see these are coming near to the cube numbers. What is 6 cube? 216. 7 cube? 343. Three. From here you get some idea. So, so 6 cube is 216 plus 1. 7 cube is 343 plus 1. Maybe, maybe, so this logic will work here. So 217 is nothing but 6 cube plus 1. What is 6 cube? 6 multiplied by 6 multiplied by 6. So the, how much it will be? 216 plus 1. So how we are getting this 217? 6 cube plus 1. Then the next one in the series is 344, 7 cube we know 343, so this is 343 plus 1, so 7 cube plus 1, so that is nothing but 343 plus 1, so what is this, 9 cube, 730 is how much, 9 cube, so these two are 6 and 7, and here naturally 9 and 10, 
so in the, in the in the exam you should not do all these things directly you can go to the answer and you can do that one so anyway for explanation i am giving this one seven that much time you are not having in the exam 730 is equal to 9 cube plus 1 what is 9 cube 729 so you should remember squares and cube these values you should remember so these are very useful for the competitive exams and entrance exams all these things anyway you have to remember so better start now itself and remember these things so by by the time you complete your mba ms and all those things you will be very much fast so next number will be what uh, 10 cube plus 1 so we have to find this number so 9 cube 6 and 7 together then naturally we will get 9 and 10 so 10 cube plus 1 10 cube means 1 followed by three zeros plus 1 so 1001 so the correct answer is <coughs> this one 1001 so in this way we can solve this problem analytical problem uh the square roots required some additional skills here you have to be little bit fast in your calculations so we have to see so here first number is what 7 plus 2 root 12 then the second one is 2 plus root 3 so what is the relation between these two you should know so that then you can find the relation between the other two So seven plus two root twelve. How we can write this seven plus any relation between these two? Maybe square of this one because this is bigger number, no? The first one is bigger. Seven plus this is two plus square or cube. Cube is not possible. Why? Two cube means eight. Two cube means two into two into two. It is eight. Two into two is four. So maybe you have this chance. We will see two plus root three whole square. You make. What is a plus b whole square? A square plus b square plus 2ab. Those who are not from mathematics background, a plus b whole square means a square plus b square plus 2ab. Here this is a and this is b. So a square means 2 square plus b square means root 3 square plus 2ab means 2 multiplied by a is 2 by root 3. So here what we will get here? 2 square is how much? 4. Plus root three is how much? Root three into root three square means root three into root three. So root three into root three means root nine. Root nine means three. Plus here these two you multiply two to four. What we are having here four root three. Now two into two multiply to four. Four root three. So this is what seven plus four root three. Seven plus four root three we are getting. But what about here? This one, seven plus two root twelve. These two are same. Seven plus two root twelve, and this one is same or not? This is same. Why? Because twelve can be written as we can change this one. See how we can write seven plus two uh, two root twelve? Seven plus two multiplied by four into three. Right? What is that twelve? So seven plus two. Multiplied this four square root of four means what two so it will come outside this two then remains here root three right square root of four means two so when it comes out it becomes two so two into two so what it is seven plus four root three so this one and this one is same so what we have observed here is uh, if this is y if this is uh, y And this is x, right? Y square is becoming x, right or not? The first term, Sec the square of the second term is coming as the first term. Square of the second term is coming as the first term. So when you make the so so here what we have two plus root five. So when you make a square, what you will get the other term. So in in other words, how we can write? If this is x, this is x square, right? In that way also we can write. If this is x, this is becoming x square. So in that way it is easy for you to understand. So instead of this one, I will clear and uh, write this one. So here, if you if you take this as the second term as x, what is the first term is becoming x square. So similarly here. the second term if you take this as x so first term should be what here the missing term it should be x square that means we have to do square of this one 
to get the first term right or not so 2 plus root 5 square whatever you will do that is the answer so this is again a plus b whole square a square plus b square means root 5 whole square plus 2 then followed by a followed by b right so 2 square is how much 4 plus root 5 into root 5 is root 25 that means 5 you will get 2 times if root if you multiply then root will go that's all so this is 5 2 plus 2 2 into 2 sorry 2 2 is 4 4 root 5 4 root 5 so 4 plus 5 is how much so this is 9 plus 4 root 5 so 9 plus 4 root 5 so this is 1 fourth one 9 plus 4 root 5 this is the answer so the relationship between these two is the second if you make square of the second term you will get the first term same way in the other part also square of the second term you will get as the first term so this is the answer here so these are some of the analytical questions i have done right if you like this uh, video what you have to do then click on the like button don't forget to click on the like button then share with your friends if you are new and not yet subscribed subscribe to this channel if you have any doubt mention in the comments thanks for watching